Hello guys, thanks for joining me. This is just a quick video about the digital tachograph card that you need if you want to become a professional driver and do it full time as a living. There is special occasions where you don't need the CPC or the digital tachograph card. If like I wanted to carry on doing scaffolding and it was driving was my secondary job, so I was driving to a place to then scaffold to then drive back, I wouldn't need a CPC or a tachograph card. Um, if I'm a farmer, hello. If I'm a farmer and I'm taking um, animals to an auction, for example, I wouldn't need a CPC or a tachograph card. There's other reasons why you don't need them. I don't think military personnel they don't need them if they're driving. But us professional drivers, we do need them. So I'm going to show you how you can get them because I went to the big Asda at Wigan today. Yesterday, sorry. And I went in and asked for uh, a DB777 form, I think it is. A tachograph card form. They said, no, they don't do them here. But you can get them at the big main post office in Wigan Town Centre. So I went there today, the day after. And they said, no, you don't do them at post office anymore. You've got to get them online. Brilliant. It cost me three quid for parking just for tell, tell me that you can only get this application form for a taco card online brilliant so i hope that you've not been mooching around town looking for them i hope you've come to this video first so you'll see now that it's a waste of time going in town to try and get one because you're not going to get an application form from anywhere apart from the internet so here we go i'm going to search for dvla I've already done this so everything will be purple. Top one, I'm going to type in tachograph form. Quick search. Apply for a digital tachograph driver card. D777B application form, that's what you need. <laughs> that's that. And that's the form that I need to fill in. And it costs £32 for this. And you can get it at any time in your training. You can get it before you even start your training. If you plan on becoming a professional lorry driver and driving for a living, then you can get it whenever you want. It takes 15 working days to come, approximately 15 working days to come, which is three weeks in it if you work Monday to Friday. So I'm gonna apply for mine now because I wanna be a professional wagon driver. So. I'll see you in a minute when I've been to the library and printed this off and then I'm going to fill it in because I've not got a printer here. Fantastic. Just go back from the library. I have got the form here. Let's go through it. Okay, this is the form. D777B in brackets DL. I will be ticking my first digital tachograph card straight over to section two. I'll be filling my driver's license number in, surname, first name, date of birth, house number, address, postcode, etc. My details have not changed from my last taco card because I've not had one. Yes, I've lived in the UK longer than 12 months. I'll be putting my telephone number in there, email address in there, signing it, dating it. Simple as that. And that's it. It really is as simple as that. <clears throat> Not add, not add at all. I like things when they're easy like that. Um, if you are renewing your tachograph card, you'll probably already know all this, you'll probably not be watching this, but if you are, it only costs you £19. It's the... Hello. Have you ever seen a bucket of slime that big? <laughs> Seriously, slime, it's everywhere. But yeah, that's that, £19 if you're renewing it, £32 if it's your first one. You can either pay by postal order or by check. Both are very simple. If you're paying by postal order, just take your application form into. Done. <laughs> if you're paying by postal order, just go into the post office with your application form and the address is on the important note sheet that you need to send it to. 
Um, it is <clears throat> DVLA Swansea SA991ST. Um, if you if you take it in, tell them that they will fill a postal order in for you, put in an envelope with the stuff that you need, and send it off. If you're paying by check, then write a check out to DVLA. Make sure you put your name and address and your driver's number on the back of the postal order and the check. Don't forget to do that or else they'll return it to you. All this information is on the important notes sheet that you print off with your application form anyway. Don't forget to get it. I would hate for one of my viewers to go all the way through the CPC module two and four, the driving tests and everything, get to the first job and go, I'm sorry mate, I've not got a taco card. I've got my CPC but I've not got a taco card. So make sure you get one. If you're gonna do it professionally, get it straight away. Get it as soon as you start your lessons, apply for it, then it's one less thing to worry about. Very quick video, I'm not gonna add it as part of my training series. It's just something that I'm doing, so I thought I'd just tell you because I tell you everything. Hope you enjoyed it, hope it helps you, hope it's inspired you, etc, etc, etc. Thanks a lot, see you later, bye. Bye, bye.